Hello everyone, I'm Spirit Killer, Portuguese Pokemon Go player, but today I will share with you a team that my friend is running on Kanto Cup because I used all my sets to the ranking, trying to reach the expert rank. Couldn't, I was near the expert rank. I reached 2660, but couldn't go much farther than that. It was a shame. I tried to reach the expert rank but couldn't and then I asked my friend to play for me in this Kanto Cup with Alon Marak in the lead, Pedro and Mew. Alon Marak in the lead is such a solid pick, it has ton of good matches. This Alon Marak is running Shadow Ball instead of the Shadow Bone to apply more pressure in the Pokemon from the opponent because Shadow Ball is such a powerful move. And of course, it's running Bone Club for baits, and it's a really fast charge move to reach. Then he's running Bidrill and Mew as a safe swaps. Bidrill is such a, an awesome Pokemon, I never thought it would be so good in the Kanto Cup with Drill Run and X Scissors, and he's running Poison Jab as a fast move. Such a powerful Pokemon. Uh, the only Pokemon I remember that counters so well Bidril are like Alon Marowak, Gengar, Haunter and I'm not seeing too often Gengar or Haunter in this cup. And then Mew, Mew it's the, the machine from this team, the very safe swap Pokemon. It's only running new moves but those moves are really bad for me if you don't reach two in a row because they are, is running Wild Charge and Hover Hit. Both moves are very powerful, but nerfs the stats from you. So, let's see how this team performs. So, let's start the battles. Let's see how this team performs in the Kanto Cup. I guess this team is quite powerful for the Kanto Cup. Let's see how it performs. Okay, a Mirror, a and Marak. Let's see how this will be played. Okay. Okay, he decides not to shield, nice. Now a bait with a bone club. Let's see if the opponent decides to shield. Okay, shielded, very well. Now this could be a bait, but it's better to shield, it was a uh, the nook. Okay, now he will do the bait again. Whoa. <laughs> Landed, nice. With that shield, okay. Now it's forced to shield and it will try to throw the shadow ball. Let's see if it can. Okay, now swap for a Snorlax. Okay, now switch for Bidril. And Bidril, for what I saw, it's a awesome Pokemon for this cup. Has great typing, awesome attacks. Should run Bidril with the drill run from the community day. Such a beast, as you see. <laughs> Shreds the Snorlax, it's really impressive. Snorlax down, okay. Now a Marak. Now a sneaky Marak with a Shadow Ball prepared. Will one shot this Marak. Okay, nice. Now Mew. Mew is the huge surprise in this team because it has only nuke attacks and nerfing attacks, so you most of the time have to charge to wild charge or to overheats. Do not nerf your stats while you are trying to reach another charge move. And as you saw, it was game over. That Lapras could do anything against you. So let's move for the next one. It's a shame, it's a shame that Kanto Cup is not a ranked league. It should be. I don't understand why it's a week without rankings. Most of the players are trying to rank to the next rank and can't because Niantic decides to this be a, a friendly cup. It's good for the players that only want to farm rewards like Yevetal from Encounters. But most of the players only play for the, the points so yeah. This was a, a weird switch for you maybe it has mistaken in the switch would be better answered with a bit drill, I guess. Okay, now it's a little tough. We will try to send the wild charge. 
and try to send another one, let's see if he can, no, couldn't, okay, but still has Beedrill, so Beedrill is the best answer for this really tough, now, okay, nice swap there, this could be a fire punch, let's see what's going to be, it was a fire punch, so a nice catch, now wait with a uh, bomb club, like we see the shield, I guess, yes, it was shielded, wait again with the bomb club, let's see if it gets the second shield, would be awesome, very good, Okay, this Manorak will likely go down, let's see, no, okay, let's see if it can reach the Shadow Ball in time, awesome, perfect, this will one shot that Hypno, now switch for the Beedrill, send the Drill Run and it's game over, very well played, good game. That was a weird switch for me in the Alone Muck match, but uh, <laughs> the Pokemons in the back of the opponent are really weak against Beedrill, so good game. Let's move for the next one. This team is performing very well. I'm impressed with this team. Okay, now a Shadow Hypno. Let's see what's going to be. This will likely be a Thunder Punch, because only four confusions were thrown to a low mirror. Now a bait with the Bone Club. Let's see if it gets the shield. No shield, okay. We'll try to do the same thing, another bait, let's see if this finally gets the shield, nice, okay, now switch for Mew, okay, this will be better shield, it was a bait again, okay, now some lag here, okay, yes, shield, let's see, okay, shielded, I'm not sure if that Hypno has the energy for a Shadow Ball, but it's okay, because Mew now has ton of energy, and this muck will likely shield once the moves from you. Now a overheat. It was not necessary. Only whatever I guess would be enough. We tried the swap but couldn't. Okay. Now this will likely see a dark boss. Okay, nice. Now we'll send a little Merrick with a bone club. Let's see if it's enough. No. Nope. We'll try with the fire spin, okay, now it was enough, now it's a good tough in the back and be drill. it's on the battlefield. With the drill run, some fast moves, with this poison jab, super effective against fairy types and it's game over, good game. I don't know if be drill or Mew in this team are the MTPs because both Pokemon are awesome, uh, Lolan Maroc is a, is a great lead as well. And we drill and move to cover all of Marak are very effective in this cup. Okay, let's go for the next one. Ouch! <laughs> a dragon air. Let's see if it can pull the win here. This will likely uh, Aqua Tail gets shield. Shield, okay. No bait here. He will we'll go for Shadow Ball. Straight Shadow. Let's see if it lands. No, it was shielded. The fortunate. Let's see what's in the back. Muck, okay, this will be problematic. You will send a overheat, let's see if it lands. Oof, awesome damage. High damage from that overheat. Mew has done the job, he's useless at this point. Now, Merrick, okay. He's forced to shield, now only commit the farm. Let's see if he can land a Shadow Ball on that Dragonair, oh, what a shame, would be nice to see a Shadow Ball on that Dragonair, that Dragonair is such a beast now, with a shield and oppressive Dragon Breaths, this will likely see the shield, we will try to reach the, the second, but I guess not, now it's a Dragon Pulse and it's game over. That Dragonair was such a wall for this team. It was a shame that uh, that uh, Merak didn't reach the Shadow Ball in time because the CMP Dragonair wants the CMP against the uh, Merak. So it would be nice, nice if this opponent let that Shadow Ball go through. <laughs> okay, let's move for the last one. I guess not sure. Now another Hypno lead. Hypno is such a common pick for this cup. It's uh, a good Pokemon. One of the best safe swaps, for me the best safe swap in this cup is Mew, because Mew is such a versatile Pokemon, such great moves, you never know what the Mew is running, 
most of the news run while charge or surf this new is running overheat instead of surf for nuke damage now it's dugong k to charge two wild charge one likely be shielded okay now the second will land will do high damage to this dugong as you see really good damage this will be a high win will KO because mid defense was lowered okay now I guess Pidgeot will have to send immediately a uh, scissors to this Dugon to not receive a ICU win let's see what's in the back okay it's Hypno again I have to throw another hex scissors no chance this Hypno must go down Okay, now it's a Venusaur in the back and it's game over. This Venusaur can do anything against Beedrill or Hello and Marek, so this match is more than over at this point. Frenzy Plant, Sludge Bomb, whatever, Marek can survive that. Now Bone Club to lower that Venusaur HP, some Fire Spin and it's game over. Yeah. That Venusaur has no game in against this team, so good game. Nice set with this team. I'm really impressed with this team. Alone Marok is such a solid pick for the lead, and Mew and Bidrill as a safe swaps. Huge options for counter the meta. For me, Mew will be the best safe swap in this cup. Bidrill is such a good Pokemon as well. The major counter for Bidrill are like Alone Marok. I don't remember if there's some rock types in this cup, maybe they exist, but I'm not sure whose rock types are running in this cup. But yeah, this team is very solid for the Kanto Cup. So, this was the video, hope you enjoyed, and see you next time.